show you guys um, all the things I had underneath um, so you guys could see how much it sucks even in the summer like if I got mine in, during the summer and I feel like I should have got it during the winter but I didn't have time because of school and work and stuff like that I'm on my summer break so I go back to school in August so it was perfect um, you know perfect time to heal and stuff but so first of all I know it's nasty and they're dirty but you have to get these foams put on these foams one goes here here and then here I can show you guys too how to put it on or how I do mine um, I'm not really an expert you know you just kind of gotta wing it but then I have this one and this is the one that they gave me in surgery but I cut out the butt so what I do is I put this one I put the foams inside and then I put this one for butt support um, on top of that one and then um, you guys will know once you get your surgery um, you're gonna collect a lot of fluid and that's what that's why you need the massages um, the lady that was doing my massages after surgery told I asked her about like all the um, so I guess when you get lipo on your stomach th the draining goes to your vagina um, that's just what the body does naturally it goes to your vagina and um, so my vagina was like fat it looked like it had liquid in it I didn't want that and what happens is some girls like don't end up paying attention to that and that's when you see like those fat ass pussies and pff, that's gross so anyways she told me to put a little tower a towel oops, just like right here right by my vagina like not my vagina but like on top like the top part of it and then so that way when I compressed everything um my body didn't or it wasn't a the compression was so hard that it wasn't able to collect anything in there so I've been doing that and it worked and I was really worried about that but it works so I'm happy that it's working and uh, I'm still early on so I don't know what my results are going to look like um, I'm still really bruised I'm taking Arnica and um, drinking the Arnica tea basically just resting and stuff like that I'm not sitting on my butt you can't sit on your butt um, but yeah I just wanted to show you guys kind of like the sucky the sucky part about it um, but I think once I'm healed and everything, I'm going to be so happy. And I'll, I'm also going to do a video of me massaging myself so you guys can see kind of what I do and kind of like what I learned from the lady that did the massages. Or, and also, I bought this massage roller because I had did some research before. And also, my, um, my surgeon told me to get one of these, but I had already got it. So I was like, oh, I'm ahead of you, surgeon. But yeah, it's ugly. I know it's green, but um, but it's been working. What I basically do is I just roll it for 15 minutes, three times a day. Um, massages are really, really important. Um, I, th I can't stress the massages enough um, because you don't want any of like that fluid or any like little balls or hard parts on your stomach or anything like that. It does suck. I'm um, doing it all the time. Remembering to do it, taking your fat off, doing it, putting it back on. Um, but it's going to be worth it. So, yeah, one of these is good. And um, if you can find a better color, that would be also be cool for you. Because you'll feel better while you're doing it. Um, but, yeah, so just wanted to let you guys know about that, all that. And, yeah, and then I'm going to do a video uh, of me massaging myself. So, that would be my next video. Thanks.